Welcome back to the Hoxley Game Project HGP here where this week it's time for our sales highlight. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell icon. You, you know the fucking semantics, you don't need me to fucking repeat them. But apparently you do because all the how-to videos say, hey, make sure you repeat these things because people forget. If you keep on forgetting to subscribe to somebody that you like, that's kind of on you. That's not on them, and in this case, me. Anywho, why don't we jump right into it. Baltoro Games is back with this 1.9 gig download. Sniper, Hunter Scope, what is it? How about the best way I can put this one is the spiritual successor to the much beloved Silent Scope or even the Virtual Cop series from Sega. My goodness. With an MSRP of $14.99, uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was very hesitant to look at this one. But I've also started to notice that this thing is always on sale. And currently, right now, for a $1.99. Okay? Put that in your head right now. This is generally a $14.99 game. It's on sale for $1.99. And what are you going to get? An on-rails sniper extravaganza with some interesting levels mixed in between where it kind of kicks to a third-person perspective and runs you in and out of cover. Kind of reminded me a little of Time Crisis and maybe... Ah, uh, it's going to drive me insane. It, th there was a police operation simulator that was kind of like a an arcade machine that it you could move on the floor and the pressure pads could figure out where you were along with the IR cameras and anywho got long-winded there what do we have we got a gallery shooter it's on rails we're zooming in we're getting rid of baddies we're doing it it's kind of comical looking but it's fun this is actually fun is it $14.99 fun fuck no fuck no but for two dollars are you kidding me you will be reliving your childhood if you are of a certain age and if you're relatively young or not familiar with these old shooters they are just fun it's all about your reflexes memorization and high scores building combos so what sets this one apart from others well, let's kind of talk about it a little bit right off the jump we just gotta go ahead and just shoot it where it hurts right away right you can tell that this came from some type of mobile background. Now, I wasn't able to find it, but the way that you earn in-game currency to unlock things was super reminiscent of those FTP kind of games, or F2P kind of games. So, that's a little off-putting, but then again, at the same time, it gives you, while artificial, some length to the game, you know, and the fact that it's actually fun to play makes it okay that you're going to be coming back over and over and over again as you grind through the levels to earn enough stars to unlock the next location, or to save up enough dollars through the in-game achievements to unlock the weapon of your dreams. When you're taking out these bad guys, terrorists, whatever you want to call them, throughout the campaign. So, from a control standpoint, thankfully, this one is playable using the gyroscopic controls and my goodness if you go into the settings and you look i need the new version gun whatever the hell that thing is i'm either gonna pump it out of cardboard my damn self i'm just gonna flat out buy it i never thought i would need it until i found this title but that's not the only way you can play it obviously you can play with the gyro controls and split con split joy cons you can play with the pro controller and move it around do your thing but you can also just use the left thumbstick and use that to move your right around and you're gonna obviously press the right trigger to fire and i say obviously because well, I mean, that's what we're programmed to do at this damn point no, obviously collecting headshots and dropping multiple targets as fast as you can is going to put you into your pseudo bullet time, but you've also got that as a power up as well as the ability to use night vision, which, I'm gonna be honest, when I first discovered it I thought it was stupid as shit, but it did. But the more I played with it, especially on some of the darker levels like you're seeing kind of right now, you'll have some enemies that will kind of tuck themselves into the shadows, and having that boost is beneficial. 
They also have grenades to take out multiple targets in one area, as well as the ability to throw back grenades that have been thrown at you. There's also mounted gun emplacements, and I'm gonna promise you there's a few more tricks up their sleeves that are worth checking out. Especially, again, at $1.99. You're not gonna need me to wait for the end of the video to say, go ahead and get this one. $2 right now, regularly $14.99. No, it's not gonna be worth it at full price. But on a sale, especially one like this, you cannot go wrong. You will have a blast, have the friends over, just do some work. Again, Sniper, Hunter Scope, 199 Nintendo eShop, go pick it up. This is HGP for the Hawks the Gaming Project. Until next time, peace!